Hi everyone and welcome to this new series in which we will be building information security management system entirely with Jira and Confluence. My name is David, I'm the COO of Audit One, and I want to share how we build our ISMS system and I want to teach you how you can do it as well so that you save on time and cost while getting yourself as secure as possible. For today, I have two main questions that I want to answer. First one is, what is Information Security Management System? What is ISO 27001? And the second one is, why are we building it with Atlassian products? First of all, Information Security Management System is a framework that integrates directly into your business processes and procedures and helps you stay as safe as possible against any kind of threats. It also builds customer trust. Your clients, especially enterprise ones, want to know that you can handle their data safely. This might also give you some competitive advantage. Being ISO certified also means that you are globally recognized as somebody who follows the best standards there are. It reduces risk and co cost in your company since you will have less accidents, um, your procedures are well-defined, and this also means that you are prepared to scale. As a startup, you might know how to do different processes, but you actually rarely document how do you actually do certain tasks in your company. With ISMS, you will be somewhat forced to document many different steps in your company. And so as you grow, as you hire more people, it will be easier for you to explain to them how to do stuff, how to um, operate, how to build, um, and they can get onboarded faster and more safer. Let's look at our second question. Why using Atlassian products? A lot of times I hear clients asking, do we need to buy some information security management system as a software or how do we build actually some ISMS? There is no need to buy any systems at all. You can build it yourself as you wish and building it actually with tools that you are already familiar with, that you have already paid for, and that you are using for daily tasks is probably the best way to build your ISMS. Because since you already have all your tasks within one space, it can directly integrate into your security tasks and thereby it will be much easier for you and your company to manage the information security together with your day-to-day -day tasks. Why Atlassian products? Well, for us, we've been using already Atlassian and that's why we just decided, hey, let's see if we can actually build everything within this system. Since you are already building everything from scratch, it will be super easy for you to also adapt, change or customize the system based on your needs. It also means that you perfectly understand every step of the way and you exactly know how your system works, where to find different evidences for the audit and you can grow and scale much faster and much easier with this system. The system that you customly build is also directly integrated, as I mentioned, within your other tasks, thereby reducing you know, the complexity of having different platforms and different tasks on different platforms and always searching for the right evidence, the task or some information. Let's look at how our ISMS looks. First of all, let's look into Confluence. So here we are in our Confluence, in our information security management system space. And as you can see, we have all of our policies defined in Confluence. Confluence gives you also the ability to restrict and manage the sharing of these policies. Most of these policies you need to share with the whole company. However, we also have some SOPs in here that we don't really want to share with everyone in the company. That's why we can use the already inbuilt features of Atlassian to restrict access to it. In this series, we will look into how to build a system like this, how to manage documents in here, how to create templates that will make it easier to create and add new policies so that you don't forget what is the structure of your documents and that you always have some information like type, confidentiality here. We will also look into how to make the document approval and what tools we use for this. And uh, we will later also look how does how do these policies integrate directly with our Jira tasks. Here in Jira, you can see some parts of our ISMS. 
we will look into detail how did we created all of these projects, how do they work, how we are, what types of issues and how do we manage all of this, how does it integrate with each other. And I will tell you in detail how you can build this and how you can customize it based on your needs. So if you're interested in building your own system with already existing tools that you have, click the subscribe button and stay tuned for the next episode. Thank you very much. See you next time.